morning everyone today is the first day of classes this is my fourth year at uva it's the spring semester which means it should be my last semester i was originally supposed to be graduating this semester but if you follow my channel at all you would know that i am actually graduating a year late because i actually switched into nursing which added an extra year for me so even though this is my fourth year at uva i'm actually considered a third year on the nursing track as much as i'm so ready to graduate it's also like wild to me that i would have been graduating this semester like i used to always think that being in your senior year of college which like technically this would have been my senior year i used to always think that that was like really grown up and just like a real adult and even though i feel like i've definitely like grown up a lot i definitely feel like i still have a lot of like growing and aging to do obviously i'm gonna be 22 in like less than two months i've recently been trying out cream contour or bronzer i don't even know what it is i don't know but i've been liking it kind of blend my big forehead can't forget the jawline and the nose so today i have three classes my first class doesn't start until 9 a.m which is wild normally nursing classes start at like 8 a.m at the latest our clinicals normally start at like 7 you have to get to the hospital at 6 45 but even one of our clinicals this semester starts later which is weird it starts at like 8 or 9 depending on the location that you're at last semester our lecture class days started at 8 a.m so the fact that they're starting at 9 this semester is like we have a whole extra hour in the morning i've also been using a cream blush i used to be so against cream products but i actually don't mind them so my first class of the day is a second writing requirement it's like the nursing version of it called real 2 then i have my pediatric lecture and then i have my community or public health lecture i always like to journal what my schedule looks like so that I can look back on it months or years from now. So I'll definitely give you guys the full rundown when I do that. This is actually a much more chill semester of nursing school in comparison to last semester. Last semester was supposedly our hardest one, but of course, knowing me, I don't know how to sit still. So I added more to my plate. I actually just started a job working on a labor and delivery unit. I'm so excited to be working there because I really want to work in L&D as a nurse one day. And I had my clinical there last semester, so I already know like what the unit's like. Since I'm new to the job, though i have to work full time for the first five weeks to like orient myself and everything and go through precepting <sighs> it's a lot guys on top of school it's gonna be rough but i know it's only for a season so it's definitely doable and it's to help build my future after those first weeks of full time i'll get to move to working once a week which is much nicer and much more manageable i'm thinking of maybe filming a vlog for like a full week of this crazy season just because i feel like that would be a fun and crazy thing to look back on okay this is the fit for the first day of classes i wore it before in one of my other vlogs like almost a year ago i think but my hair was like this short let's go eat some breakfast hey guys welcome back Wait, i don't have socks on uh oh gd h and m h and m h and m costco air pastel my sister gave these to me a long time ago wait i'm gonna i lied to you guys this is from shein this is from h and m and that's also from shein the sweatshirt's from amazon this okay. vest is cotton on amazon uh, we've got the breakfast of champions, electronic wow. cheese, and sausage. I had to break out the school of nursing mug for the first day of classes. Actually, show me your breakfast. <laughs> I don't see how many I'm eating, but croissant, <laughs> coffee, and yogurt. Yeah, um, cute. Strawberries. What's yours? What you got? Yogurt. And I yeah. ate croissant. There is literally snow on the ground. It is really chilly. Who's excited for FDOC? So excited. Woo! I've been counting down since the day I left. Anjali, what about you? Back. I'm just so excited. I don't know. I like this UVA. It's the second home. <laughs> <laughs> Here we are. Bye, Anjali. You'll be missed. We made it. Look who it is. Am I getting in the vlog? You're going to be on the vlog? We have Hannah and Nora here. Hello, vlog. They're about to start our PA class. Hello, vlog. 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 Hello, vl
How's your day been? Good. Long. Yeah. We're done with our day. How do you feel, Lauren? You know, only some of us week. All the professors seem pretty nice. Oh my goodness. I just got home. I don't know where my roommates are. I was just talking with Lauren for a while. We have clinical together tomorrow. I'm eating a burrito. There is so much on my mind. There's a lot of stuff coming up in my life with how much I am working, how much I'm doing, a lot of other stuff happening. It's just a lot for my brain to handle and classes starting too. Oh, my clinical tomorrow though doesn't actually meet for the full day. We're only doing an hour for the post-conference that we normally have. But then our first day of like the full clinical is gonna be the following Thursday, which is so nice because that means I have like most of the day off. Also, I forgot to mention that I don't even know like what my schedule fully looks like. I need to figure out like the extra for electives that I'm taking. I'm enrolled in two right now, but I'm gonna drop one. I don't know which one. I need to figure out which one. Hey, I am about to go to the gym. I really don't wanna go to the gym right now, but I am going to. Me and Mary are gonna go. I need to like actually do stuff today too because I've been getting distracted so much. This is the new sports bra. I think it's cute. I like the color, very pretty. I need to bundle up though. It's so cold outside. It's actually not like freezing cold in comparison to other places in the country. I know in some places it's literally like negative 30 degrees. It's crazy. For here, Virginia, it's a little chilly for what we're used to. I think I'm gonna put on some sweatpants over my leggings. Look at him, he's just hanging out. Wrong way, friend. Keep going. He did not go south enough for the winter. He did not. We're not that south. Mary and I are walking to the gym right now and we <laughs> ran into Ben, which never happens. This is my brother, my twin brother. I literally never ever run into him just walking around grounds. This but I do. Yeah, Mary does all the time, <laughs> which is why I probably ran into him just now because I'm with Mary. Ben just had his last first day ever. Sure did. Because he's graduating on time, unlike sure. me. How was your day, Benny? It was good. I only have one class on Wednesdays, so. Yeah. Hopefully you can hear him with the wind. It's yeah. very windy right now. Hopefully you can hear me. It's also cold out. It's really cold out. Ben is going the other way. Where are you going? Aren't you going this way? We're going to the gym. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. All right, well, I'll see you guys. Bye, Benny. Yeah. Anyway, we're going to the gym, even though it's really cold, even though we're tired and grumpy and don't want to. So, so grumpy. Me and Mary were thinking of maybe having a grumpy hangout tonight because we it's both just so feel much tired and overwhelmed. And, yeah, and grumpy. Because this is our, not our last first day of class. Yeah, <laughs> we've got a whole another year. But we're gonna go have a good workout, maybe, hopefully. This is not good for the grumpy levels. There's so many Too people. Many people. people. Guys, look at this. I can't. It's so busy. It's so busy at the gym because it's the start of the semester and the start of the new year. I'm probably just gonna do body weight stuff in here. This is our workout we're gonna do. We're gonna run. Because we love running. Love laugh cardio. Love. Love laugh love. I just got out of the shower. I'm wearing this little microfiber hair towel. They match my socks. I just like got home and a wave of just like feeling overwhelmed hit me. It's all a lot of things I feel really blessed to have in my life happening right now. It's just a lot at once and it's so busy. This would have been the semester that I could have graduated and it's just like really hitting me today I feel like to think that I still have another year and a half of school. It just feels like a lot. On top of like working now on top of school and then I have other stuff I need to figure out like my computer's making a weird sound and I need to send that in but I need my computer to edit so like I can't send in my computer and then also like some financial stuff is like being annoying right now with school so I need to like make some phone calls and figure that out my electives are dependent on that I just need to be really careful with myself and intentional with my time so that it doesn't get too crazy I feel like I didn't really rest over break that much because I was just preparing for this busy time by being really busy with my business and everything to try to get everything prepared I'm not even gonna do my full skincare right now. I'm just gonna do the moisturizer and call it a day. I'm gonna put my laundry away. <sighs> just like a mindless thing to do real quick. I got a bowl of fruit with some apples and grapes. These grapes are so crunchy. Listen, ready? Here's a little one. That alone is boosting my mood. I need to do a couple things on my computer before I journal because I want to make my class schedule on my journal like I normally do. But as soon as I open the computer, it's going to start making the annoying sound. And it's not even that bad. It's just like it makes a sound every seven seconds. I'm potentially going to be doing some brand work. So I need to read over a contract and respond and figure out dates. I'm really not in a dinner mood tonight. So I've just been like snacking all night. Right now I'm having a peanut butter tortilla. It's literally just a tortilla with peanut 
peanut butter on it and it's rolled up. I actually really like it. I need to journal. I always make the little like outline of my class schedule in my journal. I don't know what to do today though because I don't really have my schedule finalized yet, but I always do it on the first day of classes. At least I have the past few times I've done it. I could always write out what I know now and then like fill it in whenever my schedule does get finalized. Like I could do the things that are definitely not changing, which are my three lecture classes on Mondays and Wednesdays and my two clinicals on Thursdays and Fridays. So this is what my spring semester schedule looks like. It's not the full schedule just because I'm still figuring out my electives. I might have a three hour elective here or maybe a two and a half hour one here. I might also have a eight to 12 hour clinical here that would start on like the fifth or sixth week of school, I think, which conveniently would time up with when I'm done working full time because right now I'm working full time on Sundays, Tuesdays, and Saturdays. So it's three 12 hour shifts for the week for the first like four or five weeks of school, five including this current week. So today's Wednesday. This is what I did today. I worked yesterday. I didn't have classes on Monday, thankfully, since today's obviously the first day, but I did work on Sunday. So Sundays, Tuesdays, and Saturdays will be my three days of working every week for the first five weeks. Anyway, once I figure out my electives, then I'm going to add them to this calendar. It's over a month later and I'm finally uploading this video, but I just wanted to update with my finalized schedule. So I ended up taking this perioperative nursing elective. It was three hours in person for the first four weeks and now it just recently switched to a one hour Zoom. And then on Tuesdays, I have the extra clinical that's associated with it. It's in the OR. That starts next week and it's going to be eight to 12 hours of clinical. It's definitely very long, but it's actually the only class that would work with my financial situation. So it is what it is and I really love the operating room, so I'm not too mad about it. But it's not every single week, so the days that I don't do that, I'll be working a 12 hour shift or maybe having a day off because the day that I'm filming this, I actually just finished with my full-time work. So starting now, I only have to work once a week. So I could work on Tuesdays or I could do Saturday, Sunday. On the following page, you can see the 100 memories from 2023 list that I did. I made a video about that if you want to check it out. But anyway, that's what my weekly schedule looks like. And now we can get back into the video. Who decided to join me? I haven't like journaled my page yet. As you can see, I left it blank here. I think I'm gonna do that now. Mary and I are just gonna be hanging out, doing work. Probably be editing and doing some school stuff. She got cookies. Not sponsored. <laughs> <laughs> I need to go get my assortment of snacks. <laughs> nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. We got a whole range of snack assortments. I'm gonna end the vlog. I hope you enjoyed. We'll see you all in my next video, which may or may not be a week in my life. Good night to Mary. Good night, Good Good night, night to, to everybody else.